진지하게 해야 돼. 빠르게 갈까요? 속도 왕의. Hey, 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 what's going on, guys? My name is Ega, and welcome back to another episode of Lord of Heroes. Today, we will have a triple analysis of Air Lucilica, Water Lucilica, and Fire Lucilica. So, we're gonna start with Air Lucilica, one of the first contracts. Air Lucilica is one of the best heroes that can be achieved in the game through contracts. The first set of contracts includes Water Crown, Earth Lucilica, and Fire Light Ray. Having Fire Light Ray as the least used, Earth Lucilica is an attacker of the Earth Element. For me, she's one of the best strikers for her survival and great damage to a single target. If I recommend her, of course, she's very flexible and can be used for many situations. I will even dare to think that if we equip her with a full defense set, she could be a very good tank. Let's check her stats. The best stats to focus on are critical rate and critical damage. Now let's check her skills. All of her skills are really good, but her second skill, this one right here, Needle Shot. It's a beast if you want to kill a water hero in one turn. Let's check her set. Remember, use 6 pieces of first set, 2 pieces with person of attack, 1 pieces with person of defense, and 1 with life. Ring and necklace, critical hit rate, and critical damage. Optional sets, you can use the strength set, precision set, or extraction set. In the cool zone, thanks to her high speed, she can be deadly. But remember that with the current meta, the fights end very quickly because a lot of heroes use area of attack damage, so their performance can be affected. It is still a very good option if your strategy is to knock down your enemy one by one on the battlefield. Now, let's check Water Lucilica. Okay. Water Lucilica is one of the best snipers out there for her great utility and great damage in terms of indirect damage. She can lower the enemy's damage, she can remove the buff from the enemies, and with her ultimate she can poison the enemy and make him to kill himself. While doing all this she can recharge the spirit buff of the team so that a teammate can execute his ultimate, for example a striker. So, Lucy Lika Water has earned her place as one of the most incredible heroes in the game. Let's check her stats. The best stats to focus on are defense, health, and the buff rate. It's really important to try to get over 100%. Now, let's check her skills. All of her skills are really good. For right bosses, try to use her ultimate. Now, let's check her equipment. Try to use these pieces of surge which is the overcharge two pieces with person of fly and two pieces with person of defense ring and necklace use the buff ray and speed optional sets you can use the defense set in the colosseum due to the current meta the fights must end at the moment that the first hero hits so you need to hit faster and harder contrary to lucilica's style of play which consists of poison her target and watching him die slowly. Of course, there's another way to make her useful in PvP, possible by airmen her full defense, but there's another problem like her Lucilica, she can only kill one hero at a time. Now let's check the last one, a new one, Fire Lucilica. Fire Lucilica is one of the best strikers in the game. Her skills boost her damage enormously, and being new to the game brings a different factor and it is her life. Her second skill does damage according to the life she has lost. 
if she is armed with a ladle of light, by losing a percent of her life, she could do a lot of damage. Her ultimate is designed to be used against big boxes in the game or in raids. A very good option to consider. Although we already have too many good options of the fire element, she could be one of the best of them. Now let's check her stats. The best stats to focus on are health, critical rate and critical damage. Now let's check her skills. All of her skills are very good for raid bosses, but her second skill could be very good if you keep her with a lot of help to deal damage. Now let's check her equipment. Try to use 6 pieces of the first set. 2 pieces with percent of health and 2 pieces with percent of attack. Ring and necklace, critical rate and critical damage. Optional sets, you can use the strength set, precision set or extraction set. In the Colosseum, she can also work very well if she takes some damage or, on the contrary, to having her fast, she can be slow and finish the enemy. Unfortunately, she is single target like her sisters, so taking fire out of the position is going to be a really, really hard decision. Now, let's check all three Lucilicas in a PvP in the Colosseum. Okay, my first time using three Lucilicas, even one Lucilica <laughs> in PvP. Let's check how this works. Okay, and now we need to take out Chrome. Wow, look at that. It's how a new custom. Wow. Let's go with all three. <laughs> this is gonna be very nice. Wow, you are really good on defense. Let's take out Helga. Sorry, Helga. And as you can see, the basic attack of Warrior Lucic Lika reduce the attack damage of the enemy. Her second skill does. What's her second skill there? Attack the select enemy and remove all the buffs. Ah, oh, yeah. So, there's no buff on the enemy. Wow! Didn't. Yeah. Okay, well, um, that's it, that, you know, I can show you anything else, I'm gonna do, yeah, let's do one more fight, so we can see it, fire those like, uh, skills. Wow, it works. Okay, now we're gonna check her second skill against another fire one. Uh, no, let's go against her, her Aslan. Look at that damage we are receiving. And HP loss. Now let's check her second skill against. Um, I guess this one right here. Wow. Let's see. Your damage is really good. Take your objective with two. Wow. Mm. 
did it. I got all of, of I got all Lucilica's second skill up <laughs> on the second fight. That's, that's really good. Oh. And she's only Ascent 1. I have an Ascent Fireless Leak, I guess. So that's it. Thanks for watching. I hope you like the video. Please share so you can help my channel and subscribe. Hope to see you soon. Later.